Did you know there are actually two types of HIV? Most people only hear about HIV in general, but in reality, there's HIV-1 and HIV-2, and the differences between them are crucial for diagnosis, treatment, and prevention. Let's break it down quickly. What is HIV-1? HIV-1 is the most common type worldwide. In fact, over 95% of global HIV cases are HIV-1. This strain is highly infectious and spreads more easily through unprotected sex, sharing needles or from mother to child during birth or breastfeeding. It also progresses faster, meaning if left untreated, it can lead to AIDS more quickly. That's why when doctors or the CDC talk about HIV, they are usually referring to HIV-1. What is HIV-2? Now, HIV-2 is far less common. It originated in West Africa and still remains concentrated there, though cases have been reported in the US and Europe. HIV-2 spreads less easily and progresses more slowly. Many people living with HIV-2 can go years without showing symptoms, but that doesn't mean it's harmless. Without treatment, it can still lead to AIDS. What are the differences? Transmission. HIV-1 is more contagious. HIV-2 is harder to spread. Progression. HIV-1 moves faster toward AIDS. HIV-2 is slower. Geography. HIV-1 is everywhere. HIV-2 is mostly in West Africa. That's why accurate testing matters. Doctors often recommend an HIV RNA test to confirm which type you have, especially if you're at risk. Why is HIV testing important? The only way to know whether you have HIV-1 or HIV-2 is through lab testing. Early detection gives you the best shot at effective treatment, protecting your immune system, and preventing transmission. If you live in the US and want quick confidential HIV testing, visit HIVRNATestGuide.com. Don't wait. Knowing your status could save your life.